All right, here's another review for one of the ILH's hostels, and this time it's Green Milk and Honey here in Tel Aviv. Uh, now, let's talk about the great things I like about this. Friendly staff, really important. At the same time, really nice common area right here. So, just follow me. There's a place you can cook your own food, and also there's free uh, tea and coffee. And there's also really fast Wi-Fi. I test it out and it's really nice. Now, with that being said, let's go and take a look at some of the rooms here. Along the way, you can see free stuff. Yay! That's really nice. And you know, you're not gonna get bored. If the weather sucks, you can always come pick up a nice book. Hey! Maybe um, I'll pick up some Portuguese and <laughs> along the way. Um, there are rooms available with, like private rooms with really big queen size bed. And I think that's really, really nice given the fact that um, it's perfect for couples. Uh, also windows and uh, which allow us to get some fresh air. There is also uh, options where you get private rooms or so on street showers and so on. Now other rooms have also big beds are like something like this which I really like. It's really rare to find hostels with big beds like that. So that's an option on the table. Now let's take a look what I sleep and I know it's really comfortable. The beds can't complain about that. This is my bed. Uh, the mattress is really awesome. It's a little bit messy right now but the mattress is really comfortable and I can't really complain. And another great thing about it is you see every single bed has an outlet. Like I say no one needs to fight for who gets to charge their phone first or their computer first. So that is really awesome given the fact that you know I always have charged my accessory given the, my line of work. At the same time, nighttime, the light they also have every single bed has a light. It's not too bright, which means it doesn't hurt your eyes and it won't disturb your neighbors. I like that. Um, there's two en-suites inside the uh, dorm rooms and I think it's perfectly sniff, uh, sufficient and they are fairly clean. What can they do better in this one? The only thing is perhaps provide soaps and shampoos but that's like I say this is a hostel and we have to be self-sufficient. I do like the fact that they did provide me with uh, towels and also fresh linens and I can smell the freshness. So I, I overall I have to say I do like this hostel and it's perfect for budget travelers and so hopefully you can come and check out and you can write your own reviews.